You're a place you don't want to be, okay? okay? And somebody locked the door. So now you say, well, how do I get out? Well, a fourth dimensional person will just say, step into the fourth dimension. Right. That's the way which arguing with the ant to step into the third dimension. You say, I don't have access to the fourth dimension. Right. I don't even know what that means. I don't know what your word for up means when that takes you into your fourth dimension. Now, you've all heard that time is a fourth dimension. So if you were in your, in your enclosure and you had a time machine, you could go in time before you were in, in the, in the and escape the room without ever opening the door. So time acts like an authentic dimension for you if you wanna be someplace other than where you are without having to go through whatever was the, the procedure to arrive there in the first place. So if you're in a black hole, it doesn't have to be a singularity in time. You're inside the black hole, you say, I don't like it here. Get right. me the hell out. Right. Go in your time machine and just simply return. So that would be how you would escape. Using time as a fourth dimension, you just go back before you, you entered the room. I know that's not as romantic or as fascinating as other sort of elements of physics, but it would work entirely for you.